And um, now it is time for our featured speakers. So let me get my introduction before I introduce her, because I know she's chomping at the bit right now to get on. Um, I want to say just a few words about picking the topics and the speakers for the National Wake Up Call because I go back and forth between bringing on really fundamental subjects um, to get people, to get new coaches um, onto the basics and more advanced subjects that require a little more experience with coaching. I always run the risk of either overwhelming people with too much or underwhelming people with too little. But I am happy to say today is not one of those times because this is the right topic and it's coming from the right speaker at the right time. We just heard Carl talk about don't be a competitor, be a dominator. And this is someone right now who is just dominating in her business. Let me just share with you that she started a little over four years ago in 2016, she is currently right now a 10 star diamond coach. She has achieved elite four times and get this, she has achieved, achieved success club 10. Okay. So that's 10 points, at least 10 points every month for 53 months. How long has she been a coach? for 53 months. So every month since she's been a coach, she has achieved success club 10 or more. She is currently ranked number 21 in the network. Ladies and gentlemen, from Mount Pleasant, South Carolina, Erin Hopkins. There you go, Erin. How was that? Hi, that was so nice. Are you <laughs> feeling so good? Much. Were you chomping at the bit? I am. I am so excited. I am like in my <laughs> feels this morning. This is a very full circle moment for me. So I am so excited to be here. Okay. Well, before you get started, you're freezing up a tiny bit. So I want to just give you the, the, the chance for your video to catch up. All good. All good. Um, I did want to mention that you were on the wake up call over three years ago when it was not live on video and it was a conference call, but now you're live on video. Why don't you let people know um, what brought you to Beachbody in the first place? So it was about four and a half years ago. Um, I was a new mom. I had three kids. Well, let me switch my view. Okay. Um, I had three kids under three. So I have identical twin girls. And then very shortly after I had another little girl um, and I was struggling hard. I was in the depths of postpartum anxiety and depression. And I was faking it for everybody. I was making my life look really amazing. And I was silently struggling. Um, so from the outside looking in, I had everything I had always dreamed of. I dreamed about being a stay at home mom. I dreamed of having a lot of little babies. Um, and I was completely miserable and trapped in my life. And the guilt that came with that was honestly really hard to deal with. Um, during this crazy season of life, my husband had gotten laid off. And so we decided to take that time and really figure out what he wanted to do um, with his career. So he started he started a business and in any other world, besides being a beach body cup coach, when you start a new business, you don't get paid right away. So we had gone over two years without a paycheck for a family of five. Um, we had depleted our savings account. We were asking our parents for money, which I'm so grateful about that, but it was totally and completely soul crushing. Um, our marriage was hanging on by a thread. We were in counseling and not sure um, what was gonna come of that. And my little girls were getting the worst version of their mommy. Um, whew. I was falling back into, after a lifetime of like emotional eating and disordered eating, I was falling back into those old patterns. So I was struggling hardcore pretty much in every way. I was spiraling out of control. And I was watching an acquaintance on Instagram live a pretty amazing life. I was watching her be in the best shape of her life. I was watching her have this awesome job where she got to help people, but still be a super present mom. Um, and I watched her with this crew of women, with this crew of women linking arms and doing amazing things while I was at home isolated and trapped in my life. 
Um, and I was jealous, like dying of jealousy. And although for seven months I had said no and ghosted her, um, one night, likely after too much wine, I messaged her and I said, nobody knows, but I'm not okay. Everything's falling apart and I need help. Can I please join your boot camp? And so she said, of course, come on, babe. Um, and I started her boot camp. I started with 21 Day Fix Extreme and I lost 20 pounds in two rounds of this amazing program. Um, but it was day five. It only took five days for me to start feeling like myself again. It took five days for my husband to say like, hey, you're kind of okay today and we're kind of okay today. And whoa, what's happening? This is awesome. Um, and it took five days for me to know that I had to pay this forward. I knew that I had to tell all of my friends and I had to help all of the mommies that were struggling. Um, and I remember like, I was like, oh my gosh, like I'm going to get paid for this. I remember the first paycheck I didn't do the direct deposit. It like came in the mail and I'm like, I freaking love this thing. And it's bringing me back to life. And I just got paid for helping people do this too. Like, what is this life? And then I started watching my coach who was guiding me every step along the way. And I saw what was happening to her family. And I saw the financial freedom that she was creating. Um, and she works really hard. Beach Beachbody guarantees no level of success. And I started realizing that the more people that I could help, the more money I would make. And so it was like that. I realized that I had the power and I could get us out of this financial nightmare just by helping people do this thing that I already really love. Um, and so the flip switched and it was game on, let's go all in. I, I love how people uh, say, the, um, say the disclaimer and yada, 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 you know, Beachbody doesn't guarantee any level of success. It all depends on your diligence and skill. Uh, so I'll just put that in there for you. Um, there's another thing that you said, Erin, that I want to make sure people heard. You felt trapped. And I think what happens is that the way people feel inside about it, in their lives about feeling trapped, they are responsible for doing something about it. And what you did was you jumped in, you finally got the courage to jump into a program and get yourself back and get your confidence back. So the feeling of feeling trapped is something we put on ourselves. And to get out of it, we have to find that, that energy and courage to get out of it. So I love that you shared that. It is so important that people understand that there is an option outside of that feeling of feeling trapped. So I appreciate you being so honest about that, Erin. Um, okay, we are ready for the big topic of the year. Why don't you talk about why this topic, why now, and just jump in on how you tackle it. Well, y'all, like, first of all, did you hear that recognition? <laughs> like, did you hear all of those new rank advancements, all of those new diamonds, all of those new star diamonds? I swear every week I have chills every week. So excited because these are the people who made a decision to level up their lives. They decided they want more for their life, for their families, and they decided to make a decision and go for it. Um, they know that we have the opportunity of a lifetime at our fingertips. And with the mess that is 2020, people need us more than ever. People need us from a mental health standpoint. People need help with their health and fitness, and they need an at-home fitness solution. And people need an additional stream of income. And I wake up every single morning so grateful for what this business has given me. And I feel responsible for paying it forward every single day. And so I made a decision that this year was going to be our year. And I made a decision that I was going to help as many people as I could duplicate the success that I've had. Um, and so I made a decision to get laser focused on helping my new coaches really get started right and helping my new coaches get to diamond quickly. Um, and truly, <laughs> I've had, our team has had some massive growth, right? And so has our entire company. It has been incredible to watch. Um, what is normal for my team in a year is to advance four diamonds. And this year we've advanced 14, which is so fun and so exciting. 
exciting. Um, and so what I want to do today is take you through the process and the shifts that I've made in this business. And so if you're a diamond or a star diamond coach, congratulations. I feel like you get it. And I'm so excited for you. And hopefully what you're going to get from me today is how to find that duplication. And if you're a new coach, I want to take you through this process, the same process that I take my new coaches through. And I, my hope is that you're going to get excited and that you're going to make a decision to go diamond because I believe that the fun and the impact starts there. Um, so we're going to do this thing. So I looked at this huge shift in my business. Okay. What was happening last year that was resulting in four diamond advancements, which is, which is great, but what was the big shift that took it to 14? Um, so I took a step back and I looked at my onboarding process, what I do with my new coaches when they come in. And this is what I used to do. I am so fired up and pumped about this business that I would get them on a call and I would be like, welcome to the team. I'm so excited. And I would word vomit all over them. You guys, I would talk about success club, Emerald, Diamond Roadmap, success starters, all of the things. And they're like, whoa, girl, like this is like something that was supposed to be fun and easy and you just scared me and overwhelmed me. And this all of a sudden seems hard when y'all, this business isn't hard. It's so simple. And so what if we just simplified the get to diamond process? We simplified this getting started process for them. So I took a step back and I'm like, what do new coaches really need to know? And again, y'all, it's simple. What am I doing? This is a learn as you go business. What am I doing telling all these new coaches about team cycle bonus and rank advancements? They don't need to know anything about that yet. I took a step back and I looked at my team and I looked at the entire network and I, I studied the successful coaches and their stories. And I wanted to find out what the common thread was. What is the thread that makes them successful? And it became so crystal clear that to be a successful coach in this business, you simply have to love this. That's it. The coaches that you're seeing on these calls and you know, crushing this business are crushing it because they had some kind of life-changing situation because of these programs and because of these products and because of this opportunity. They have the belief and the passion to share this and they feel responsible to serve. And so I was sitting here leading with the businessy stuff because I like the businessy stuff when it's the journey that they need to focus on. And so that was the major shift that happened. And it all really starts on my Sunday night call. So every Sunday night, I host a call um, for any new coaches that signed up this week, that week. So sometimes it's one, sometimes it's 15. You just never know. And um, I think they probably think they're going to get on this call and learn like all of the businessy things. And they might, they, they are not, that's not what's happening. I want to tell them the three things that I feel like they need to know in month one to be successful. I don't want to overwhelm them. I want to simplify this process and I want to keep them it fun. So three things on my Sunday night, getting started call. First thing, their job is their journey period. I talk about the common thread and I talk about the top coaches and I get them excited about how this is going to change their lives. And it's their job to learn the nutrition program and watch the video and follow it, follow it to a T. It's their job to print out the workout calendar and check it off every day and go all in 100% with their workouts. It's their job to lean into these online boot camps and this amazing community. And all of these women who are all of these people, men and women who are getting themselves back on the priority list, it's our job to be their cheerleaders. That's our job. How cool is that? So we need to get them laser focused on their journey and truly treating that as their number one priority. Number two, second thing they need to know is they need to get excited. This excitement is contagious. And when you are excited about this, your friends and your family are going to want to be a part of this amazingness. So number two is get excited and get three to five people to join you on this journey. They're going to sign up the same way you did for the ultimate solution, the challenge pack. They're going to get that fitness, nutrition, and support. And what I'm telling them in this moment is that we're just talking about your inner circle, like your Thanksgiving dinner table that's about to happen. 
Those are the people you're asking to join you. Those are the people that you want to be your accountability partners, people you genuinely want to be on this journey with. And they're not the experts. I'm saying that this is how um, they're going to invite some, someone saying something like, okay, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I'm so excited and I'm joining this boot camp. And like, do you want to do this with me? We could be accountability partners. It would be so fun. That's it, guys. They're getting excited and telling their friends and they're bringing three to five people on this journey with them. And I always tell this story about when I had three kids under three and I'm like dying of postpartum anxiety. And I remember the morning I had to take all three of my kids to the pediatric dentist. And I, there were so many tears and breakdowns and I honestly just didn't know if I could survive it. Like I didn't know if this was gonna be okay. I didn't feel like I could handle it. And I get to the dentist and I'm gonna have these three little girls under three and these like angels from heaven behind the front desk come and like swoop my kids away and everybody's laughing and happy and nobody's crying. And I had the most magical pediatric dentist experience ever. And you know what I did? The first thing I did when I got to my car, I strapped all my kids in and I got my phone and I texted every single mom that I know in Mount Pleasant, South Carolina. And I said, you guys have to go to Kids Teeth in Mount Pleasant. It is amazing. These angels from heaven work behind the front desk and we just had the most amazing experience ever. You've got to go. So what happened a year later when I went to the pediatric dentist, they're like, Mrs. Hopkins, thank you so much for telling everyone you know in life. Here's $900 in referral bonuses. It's the same thing here, guys. We have this thing that we're excited about and that we love, and we're simply getting excited and sharing it with our friends. The same way that you would like ask somebody to run a five random Thursday night 5K with you. So super excited or super important that they're getting excited and helping three to five people. And I want them to kind of see why. I want them to see that when they have their mom, their sister, their cousin, their next door neighbor doing this with them, they're gonna show up differently. And on days where they don't want to love their nutrition or they don't want to, you know, drink all their water and get their workout in, they're going to because they roped their people in on this. And on days when you don't want to show up for yourself, you are going to show up for those three to five people. And it is going to be so much fun and it is going to be so much better together. I also want them to recognize that at the end of the first program that they're doing, whether it's 21 days or 30 days or whatever, they're not only going to have their experience and their transformation, whatever that looks like from them, from the inside out, they're going to have a portfolio of transformations. How powerful is it when you get to say, oh my gosh, look what happened to me. My mindset's completely different. My body's completely different. I feel amazing, but even cooler, look what happened to my mom. Look what happened to my work wife. Look what happened to my bestie. Like these programs work. And now you have a portfolio of transformations that prove that. How cool is that? And of course, the three to five people thing is really important to me as a business mentor. Because when a new coach signs up with me, my first goal with the, for them is to get their investment back. This is a business. I want them to make money. I want them to make money in week one. And by helping three to five people with a challenge pack, you're not only going to cover their investment, but they are going um, to start making money. And they're going to start seeing that the more people you help, the more money you can make and how cool that is. And then... The third thing. So we have um, your job is your journey. Number two is get excited and help three to five people on this journey with you. And then number three is to start sharing now. And y'all, I'm so guilty. I am so guilty. I remember, you know, I had that day five moment where I was in love with this and like it was bringing me back to life. And my husband and I were kind of okay, this magical moment. And when I told my coach, my coach Moira, she said, Aaron, Oh, I told her, I love this. I want to coach. I want to help all the silently struggling moms. That's always been my number one goal, but I can't do it until I'm at my goal weight. So when I lose 20 pounds and I have this jaw dropping transformation and I get like 200 likes on the post and I get to like, you know, wrap it up into the bow and say like, look, then I can start helping people. And she's like, stop. Nobody wants fitness Barbie. <laughs> Nobody wants this final perfected version of you in your head. They want you, the version of you right now, the messy mom who's making this happen. And so I did, I started sharing now and y'all four and a half late years later, my entire business has been built on being super relatable and bringing people on this journey with me. And four and a half years later, I still fall off my journey and I get back on because I have this amazing community and I have these amazing tools 
And people have been on that journey. So all of these new coaches who are scared the way that I was of it not looking perfect, I just want them to share authentically and not talking about the highlight reel. People want to be on this journey with you and they need to see you showing up and they need to see you being consistent. Okay, so that's my getting started call. Um, and then in month two is my favorite. This is like to me where the magic happens, right? Because they have just finished their month one. They are excited. They are feeling amazing. They're like bursting with pride about the work that they just put in and their three to five besties and family are feeling amazing too. So they are on fire about this business and excited to share more. Um, and y'all, I hope you heard that in that kickoff call, that first call that I did when I shared the three important things, they didn't hear anything about success club, nothing about points, nothing about rank advancings, nothing about emeralds. All they heard was get excited, help three to five people, right? So if they did what they were supposed to then, they have accidentally hit their first two milestones in their business. They are accidentally in success club and they are accidentally an Emerald coach. They've opened the doors to their business without even knowing, without dealing with the overwhelm, without feeling businessy. They just got excited and fell in love with this and they had their first two major wins. Okay, so how, uh, it's so awesome, it's so exciting. Um, and then on this call, I get to start sharing what that means, why Emerald's important, why Success Club matters. Um, we start talking about things like success starters and uh, compensation plans and stuff like that. I hand them the Success Club tracker, which as we know, is literally the formula to success in this business. And I get to introduce them to their next steps, which is diamond. And just in case you're new here or you need a refresher, this is the diamond roadmap. If you Google this and say diamond roadmap team Beachbody, there's like 1 million versions that will show up, but simply diamond is 12 people. You sign up four people on your left. You sign up four people on your right. Two of those people are super excited and get two friends and families members involved and bam, you are a rock star diamond coach. That simple. It's just 12 people. And I believe that diamond coach, that being a diamond is hugely important. And I want them to understand why. The, the financial impact in this business happens at two star. No question about that. And diamond is a stepping stone on the way to two star where that financial impact happens. However, the impact at diamond is equally as important because I believe that the impact at diamond is legitimacy. It's the hype. It's the excitement. It's the FOMO. All of a sudden, these people that have been watching you are seeing you shouted out on this national wake-up call and in your team pages. You're in the top 3% of the company. You have a team and you are a leader. And all of a the sudden, these people are like, whoa, she's really doing this thing. She's legit. Like I've been watching her and she didn't quit and she's doing this. And I don't know what a diamond coach is, but it's amazing. And if she can, maybe I can. It matters. The impact at Diamond matters, and it's going to set your business up for massive success. Um, and I have so often coaches come to me and they're like, I can't get to Diamond because I don't have the working coaches. And to that, I say it's like the chicken or the egg thing. Like what came first, the chicken or the egg? What came first, the working coaches that got your, you to Diamond? or the diamond legitimacy and status that attracted the people who are gonna run with you, that attracted your working coaches. And I believe it's the latter. I believe that legitimacy is gonna bring the people in, that hype and that excitement is gonna bring the people in that are truly gonna run with you. Um, and I get to show them their diamond roadmap. And this is where all of the magic happened, guys. Here's their diamond roadmap. But as you know, they helped three to five people last month. So I got to fill in the little bubbles of the people that they've already helped and show them that they are halfway to this amazingness. They are halfway to this milestone that could change their business and change their lives forever. Um, and how easy is this? Again, taking out the overwhelm, simplifying this, showing them that this doesn't have to be hard and that I believe that they can do it. So it's in that moment that they make the decision. It's in that moment that they decide that they're going to help more people and become that legitimate rock star diamond coach. 
You know, there is so much here that I am so proud of you about, Erin. First of all, in your story, feeling trapped, now feeling like you're dominating in this business, which is kind of what Carl was talking about with the book, The 10X. Um, Mike, I'm going to ask you a question that's, you know, off script a little bit. And that is when you first started, did you bring your friends and family on or, or were people just poo-pooing it? Or did they see the excitement in you and want to be a part of something that you were doing? They saw the shift in my life. They couldn't help but say, girl, what are you doing? Oh my gosh. Like you're just different. You're the, you're, you're coming back to life. Um, and they couldn't help. All these mommies were seeing me work out at home alongside my little babies, literally crawling all over me all the time. And that I could get back on the priority list and that maybe they could too. Well, it sounds like you had come out of your funk and found your excitement, found your happy, you know, turned yourself around and then people started kind of gravitating to that energy. Because, you know, I talk about it on the wake up call a lot and that is, can you teach excitement? Can you teach that, you know, extroverted energy that people have? Can an introvert you know, be a coach. And it really is, is, you know, once you get your own results and you feel happy from within that you, you, that is exuding from your body. So I, I just wanted to ask you that question because some people don't ask their friends and family to, you know, sign up. Um, but it sounds like it was perfect for you. It was, and I found that it's perfect for so many of my coaches because it gives them the confidence to start reaching out to people that they're not quite as comfortable with. Yeah. Um, again, they have their like kind of their test group, right? Of friends and family that are doing this with them that got excited and got results too. And it all goes back to like what we said that your job is your journey. Like the rest of this doesn't fall into place if you didn't get results and fall in love and feel different. You know what? That was well said. I appreciate that. And I'm going to let you now close the call with, um, you know, how do you feel four and a half years later? What has coaching done for you and your family? Oh, no. <laughs> um, oh, no. <laughs> this has completely changed my life in every way. My little girls get the mommy that they deserve. My husband got his wife back and my marriage is amazing. I have a commitment and I still get to be at the bus stop every single day. I have a community of women that literally force me to dream big, that make me level up my life. And I feel like this all has turned me into the version of myself that I was meant to be. Um, I didn't know I could be a mom boss. I didn't know I could speak on a call. I didn't know I had any of that in me. Um, and Beachbody has given us this platform and this gift. And it's really cool, all the amazing things that have happened in my life and the financial freedom that I've gotten because of this. Beachbody guarantees a lot of success. You got to work hard. But what's even cooler um, is the ripple effect. Like how many babies got their mommies back? How many husbands got their wives back? How many mommies? are off their antidepressant and back in the pictures with their babies. It's unbelievable. How many women did we, who were silently struggling the way that I was, finally have a community and an outlet and a place to go. And that's really cool. But there's also this other ripple effect. When I get to see my coach pay off, make her final check to pay off the debt that she thought was gonna follow her around for the rest of her life. When I get to see my coach quit her job and go home to be her babies, it's unbelievable what is possible and th that we can create whatever life that we want if we're willing to work really hard and hustle. And if you really have the heart to help people, anything is possible. And I'm so grateful every day for Beachbody. And now I'm looking at this mess of 2020, right? this mess that we're in and all of the marriages that are falling apart and people's mental health is just not okay. And they need an at-home health and fitness solution and they need an additional stream of income. And we have the answer. We have the answer. 
And of course, there's so much hard work and effort and skill and diligence and whatever else we need to talk about to disclaim that. But our work matters <laughs> more than ever. And I believe that the sky is the limit. And I believe that Beachbody has changed lives. And as a whole and as a network, we have this powerful tool and this responsibility to create that ripple effect. You know, I have a theory and it is if you talk about your life and it makes you cry with gratitude, you're doing something right. And you are so welcome at Beachbody, you know, for the work that you've put in and how you've dominated um, that you, it, it is a ripple effect. What, what you're feeling just exudes. And I am so happy that you talked about this today. It was a great topic. I hope people go back and listen to it. Um, and thank you so much. You crushed it, Erin. And uh, we'll see you later. Um, and I am going to share the um, something that Carl said at the very beginning of the call that Grant Cardone and the 10x rule that uh, book that people are reading. Don't be a competitor. Be a dominator. Let me let me show that. Um, it's time for you to dominate your life and stop feeling trapped by it. You have the power, the courage, the control. I am saying this because it is hard. Everything is hard that is worth it. And today is a brand new day for you to think differently, change your mindset and dominate today, dominate this week, dominate your business coaches. It has been my pleasure today to be on the call with all of you. We will see you here next week. Bye-bye.